Hello friends, I'm Larry with Rides Den Right, and this is Journey to Track Knees. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. That's fun to take that take, what? Uh, little cheaters. <laughs> <laughs> well, we know it went pretty good. <laughs> That's why well, he dumped it on the second <laughs> session. and <laughs> So then we do the recap, we do the preface part. Well, we'll just have to wait and see. You know, we're hoping everything's going to go good. And well, you uh, heard, you know, fingers Matt, crossed. You know Matt Maladin's quote. I could just see this. Well, Larry got out there, and he ran out of talent when he needed it most. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Maladin once said that a guy came up to him, and you know who Matt is, don't you? I love Matt Maladin. And, and some guy says, you know, you come down the hill, Matt, and you just, you crash. What happened out there? He goes, well, it appears that I ran out of town when I needed it most. <laughs> just Matt and his no bullshit, just business. That I'm like, oh, my God. That's I swear, I have a lot of favorites in, as a fan. I yeah. have a lot of favorites. Matt Maladin is one of my all-time you know, favorites. Cla- we, he I don't was know. so cool. It sounds like you got him kind of at his peak, too, because there oh, was, it was, there was a time quit. where he was... Everybody knew. I mean, there was Valentino Rossi. Where's For Matt U.S., Blatt, yeah. if you watched the U.S., you oh, Matt, Matt Dominant, was the champion. man. He, there All was times where you couldn't touch it. He, he would waste everybody. He would. It wasn't even. It felt like he was just playing with everybody on the track. And what I'm getting at is, you don't. You, you, like I said, I didn't dislike him, didn't. But you had this very business brash person behind the scenes. A total gentleman. Wow. He stayed. He he basically said, "Schedule. I have to be here. I can't stay for the banquet. Most of them stay for the banquet, so you can meet people afterwards. You can ride with them on the track, talk to them, and then you can also go have dinner, which is a really cool thing when you're riding with your heroes." Anyways, Matt said, "I can't stay for the banquet, but I can do this, this, and this." I mean, it was just a class act. You go, here is a guy at the top of his profession could be a total asshole, and he was great. Another one that has come to every single one of them is Josh Hayes. And you want to talk about just the coolest Probably guy? Probably the coolest just person on the, the planet. Coolest I mean, dude. that guy is so oh. cool. And he's just, as he is off screen, he is on screen. I mean, I have so many Josh stories I can tell you my, over the years. My introduction to him was Two Wheel T- Tuesdays with Greg White. And he would have his, that was my favorite show on TV. I watched it every week. Greg I came watched the first two years. He brought the camera. Did he really? We were on Two Wheel Tuesday. He came the first two oh, years. Yeah. Man, <laughs> he was so cool. I mean, I loved his show. And then. That's where you got to every week. That's where I met the Haydens. It's where you yep. met Josh Hayes. It's where you met the Bostroms. It, it brought us, brought all those guys into our homes where we got to kind of know them. Yeah. And Josh Hayes. Oh, there's no one cooler. You can't, there are some things you just, you can't make up that. If you, yep. if you ever see him in an interview, you go, you go, that's the real guy. Yeah, that's exactly what he's like. Oh, I love yep. that guy. Josh came to my first Seattle 100 and was at every single one of them. Um, I think I had maybe one. And see, so you, you when he rode for Attack Kawasaki, and I think it was a 750 Super Sport champion, that was the first time he came. No ego then. He came all the way up to his AMA Super Bowl. Never once added to I mean, I can. I have so many just just cool stars of Josh. Just like He's all over. my, my I have a 14-foot yeah. wall poster in my yeah. garage. Oh, yeah. one, so, of my, yeah, one of my favorite cool. stories is he came, and my son that's here today, the little guy there, he was really small. He was probably, he's 15 now. He's probably eight. And Josh put him in front of me, took him to Pacific Raceways, and Josh went out and ripped with him on the bike. Brings him in, looks at me, and goes, well, now you can tell your dad you've been around the track faster than he, and I'm not slow. And without, and just rides off, I'm like, Josh, ouch! But I mean, that's Josh! And he knew, he knows me. He's, I mean, mother favorite Josh Hayes story is 2008, it was at Miller Motorsports Park. I was racing Amy, and I'm battling not to get laps. That's my level with the pro, so I'm being honest. I'm out there in the 600 Super Sport, and it's one of the practice. Near the end of the session, Josh goes by, sees me, slows down, taps his tail, and pulls me around for a lap. He's at a pro race where wow. he's making money. This is professional. Wow. He takes the time to, to give me a lap. Oh, I'm like, just, wow. I got all kinds of stories. Just that class, is so cool. Class act. I just have always you, admired Josh. Going that back way. to Matt, do you remember when he blew that tire out at 160 miles an hour? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Uh, I was watching it live. Back in the day, they had a lot of AMA on TV. Yes, they did. On Speed Channel. Yep. And I, it was on a Sunday afternoon or a Saturday afternoon. I don't remember. But I remember yeah. when it happened. I mean, my eyes just rolled. It, it, oh. Anybody who rides he motorcycles, saved it. He saved it was it. like, we. that's what we all said. For all the stuff, even though it fell over at the end, it's like, give yeah, me it, like, a in break. The he should have. 
he, at, at 140 or 130, he should have been rolling yep. and it just wadded up. I could not believe that. Yep. Ah, uh, that's the biggest freak out I think I've ever seen. I mean, I don't. Yeah. I mean, although there's been, you know, some stuff that. Colin Edwards having his bike on fire having to bail off was pretty good, too. Remember that one? <laughs> yes. <laughs> there's another dude. You want to talk about oh, a cool dude? Is he, is he as cool as he, he is? Seems. I've met him several times, and uh, he's the next guy I want. His dad is so funny in the in the <laughs> doctor, the Kentucky kid, and the tornado, the doctor tornado. tornado, and the Kentucky kid. Yeah. His dad is so funny in there, and, and and he goes, he goes, it's when he's getting to go to, on pavement and from dirt, and he, and he looks over to his dad and he goes, Dad, can we do it? And he looks over and he goes, Hell yeah, we can do it. That was his dad. <laughs> and his dad Texan, man. Just all, on, all in. It's like, you bet we can do son, it. Son, you better get out before I kick you in the ass. You, what are you doing here jibber jabbing? You should be out there riding, you know? He, he instantly <laughs> became my favorite dad in the world. Yep. He was so cool. Yep. The yep. I, I mean, you, you got to say, Earl, with the stories that they have. Earl's got amazing stories. With story. what they sacrificed. Yeah. Nobody that hasn't lived motorcycles can't understand what Earl did for those kids to get them where Even they his got. Daughters, his daughters were badass riders yeah. too. That, boy, you talk about a, a sad uh, year for a, a lot of us that were really, in a I know. Bicycle friendly country like Italy too. If all, it wasn't like in America. It's like, what? And the dude I have catered. A, the I dude have a 69 right there it. on my fender. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like, I got a Honda so I'm going to have that Classic. on there. Uh, I think he was, was another cool. one I wanted to get. Anyways, we got to get ready. Fun times with Larry. I'm so proud of you today. You did great. Thanks, man. Well, it was a blast, and uh, you guys keep watching. we got a lot coming. There's going to be a lot of videos out of this, and we're going all summer, so we'll see you next time. Yeah, yeah. I like yeah, how yeah. we did that. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> I had to get that in. It's, it's I love that when you're on the it's, wall and you sit there with your hand waving like you do, and you go, turn it to track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's funny because... Because when I did it, when I did it, we both started laughing so hard, and it was like, I think I got to keep that in there. Oh, it's, it was it's just like so Larry's funny. little tagline. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna get.